If Courage could be said to have a face, it is the face of Edgar Hernandez. The 16-year-old from Hidalgo, Mexico, was burned over 80% of his body in a fire. He's being treated at Shriners Hospital for Children in Galveston, Texas, one of the country's major pediatric burn centers. Burn pain is classified as among the worst types of pain, and twice every day Edgar endures agonizing physical therapy needed to keep his damaged flesh from stiffening and contracting, which would render his limbs useless. He endures it without complaint, but even with heavy doses of narcotic painkillers, the suffering is awful. Today, however, Edgar will escape from the world of pain to another, more soothing place with the help of virtual reality. This is called Snow World. It's an interactive virtual reality program specifically designed to help overcome pain. And it works. I feel less pain when I play the game, less pain than before. I feel like I'm in a place where there's snow, another world. With less pain, Edgar's therapy is more effective, and he gets better faster. He's so caught up in the game, he doesn't even pay attention to what I'm doing. So each session just gets better. He knows what, he's, what to expect. And then she decided Snow World is the brainchild of psychologist Hunter Hoffman. Pain requires attention. The virtual reality lures the attention away from the pain and leaves less attention available to process the pain. So basically, the patients are distracted by interacting with the virtual world. Today, some of the patients at Shriners are having a Christmas party. Many are from Latin America. All are terribly familiar with searing pain. For these children, the virtual reality program is a godsend. Patients not only report feeling less pain, but brain scans done on test subjects show a big decrease in pain-related brain activity. It doesn't just change the way you interpret incoming signals, pain signals. It actually changes the way the brain processes pain. Right now, Snow World is being carefully studied and evaluated in eight hospitals around the U.S. The developers of Snow World hope that once the tests and studies are complete, the technology will be widely adopted potentially giving tens of thousands of people, like Edgar, real relief from excruciating pain. And not only for burn patients. The program can work with cancer patients, amputees, or any other types of severe pain. That's the, what I have cut out for me for the rest of my life, is to transition this from a research tool into clinical practice where it's just used as standard of care. That's what I'm trying to get done. And that means that people in pain will someday no longer have to rely on courage alone. Rob Reynolds, Al Jazeera, Galveston, Texas.